Hey guys! Welcome back to the channel! Today we've got something really exciting to talk about, especially if you're a fan of high octane racing and jaw dropping speed. We're diving deep into Street Outlaws and the return of none other than Justin Swanstrom to Radio vs. The World RVW in his infamous car, Blood Money. Not only is he coming back, but he's bringing with him a whole new powerhouse Noonan combo. And trust me, this is something you don't want to miss. But first, let me set the stage. Let's take a trip back to when Justin Swanstrom first stepped into the world of RVW. This is a man who's seen it all, from drag racing on nitrous to making waves in the pro mod world. He was fast, he was fierce, and he made a name for himself. But, as with all great competitors, Swanstrom doesn't rest on his laurels. He's constantly pushing the limits of speed, and now, with his return to RVW, he's looking to shake things up in a way we haven't seen before. Now, back in the World Series of Pro Mod, Swanstrom ran his blood money car with very limited test time. We're talking big tires, a new end slash screw blown setup, and just enough time to get the feel for the beast under his hands. And despite that, he made some serious waves. But now, he's stepping things up, way up. Let's get into the technical side of things for a minute. Justin's new engine setup? Oh man, this is a beast like no other. He's going all out with a motor tuned for high overdrive, running at 125% overdrive. To put that into perspective, when he's out there in No Prep Kings, NPK, his setup runs at around 98% over. Even when he dabbled with radial racing before, he was hitting about 110% overdrive. But this time, 125% overdrive. That's a whole new level of power, torque, and speed. Just imagine the insane boost that extra power will give him on the track. We're not just talking a small bump here. This is a rocket strap to a car. That increase over what he's used to in NPK, combined with Justin's mad driving skills, means the competition better watch out. Now, here's the fun part. Not long ago, Justin made a little post teasing everyone about switching over to a Pro Charger. People went nuts. But let's be real, folks, when you've got a screw blower set up like he does, you're not trading that in for anything. Especially when you're racing on tracks as unprepped and unpredictable as RVW. I mean, come on. It's all about keeping that insane speed while maintaining control, and a screw blower is perfect for that. Plus, he's got multiple engines ready for this type of setup, so he's sticking to what works and what's deadly on the track. The power Justin is bringing into this race with his new motor setup is going to make some serious noise in the world of radial racing. Just look at what Stevie Fast did recently. He ran 212 miles per hour and a 3.52 ET with a similar setup. Justin Swanstrom is looking to put up numbers like that, or even better. Let's talk about his past in RVW for a second. Justin isn't a newbie here. He's raced in RVW before with a Nitrous Pro Mod back in 2018 and 2019, and guess what? He did pretty damn well, hitting the 3.60S with his Nitrous setup. But here's the kicker, the screw blower combo he's got now? It's a whole different animal. More power, more consistency, and less weight to throw around. Now, if you know Justin, you know he's not the smallest guy. And in racing, weight matters. The lighter you are, the faster you can go. That nitro setup was great, but it didn't let him shed those extra pounds. But with his screw blower combo, he's got a lot more wiggle room, and this thing is a monster when it comes to power. He's no longer held back by weight restrictions, and that's going to give him a real shot at taking down the top names in the sport. And speaking of competition, can you imagine Justin going head-to-head -head with some of the biggest names in RVW? Racing against guys like Stevie Fast and all the other top-tier radial racers, it's going to be an absolute spectacle. The hype is real, and I can't wait to see these two powerhouses on the track together, pushing their cars and their skills to the absolute limit. Guys, this is what racing is all about. It's about the thrill, the chase, and pushing the boundaries of what's possible. And if there's one thing we know about Justin Swanstrom, it's that he's never one to back down from a challenge. So, buckle up, because when November rolls around, and Blood Money hits that track with its new Noonan combo, you better believe it's going to be something for the history books. 
So, who's excited to see Justin Swanstrom back in RVW? Drop a comment below if you think he's going to tear up the competition, and don't forget to hit that like button if you're ready for some high-speed, adrenaline-pumping action. Thanks for watching, and as always, stay tuned for more updates on all things racing. Catch you in the next one.